During severe weather days like this one, home and auto insurance are very important. They certainly are. And starting today, a major insurance company is making it more difficult for new customers to get a policy with them as it tries to limit its risks in some parts of the country. Paolo Suro breaking it all down for us tonight. Paolo, what's going on with this? Absolutely, guys. Well, you know, Nationwide is actually the latest insurance company to change the way it does business and says it had to because of the impact of inflation and different catastrophic weather events. And recently, companies like State Farm, Allstate, and Farmers have made similar moves in specific states like California, which, as you know, has been dealing with the wildfire. So how could this impact you? We spoke to an expert who breaks it down. Starting today, Nationwide Insurance is asking for more documentation for new personal lines before approving a policy quote in certain states, including Georgia. CEO of Portal Insurance, Bradley Flowers, is not affiliated with Nationwide. But I've talked to some folks and they basically said that they're going to look at around a seven day turnaround before they, they turn insurance quotes around. So what they've effectively done, they're limiting the new business they're writing without actually physically saying that because obviously if you go to an insurance agent for a car insurance quote or a home insurance quote and they take seven days to turn it around, that's that's not conducive to getting a policy written in a certain amount of time. He explains this is happening as rates for insurance companies themselves to protect their bottom line are currently very high. The reinsurance is actually costing them more than it did the prior year. Therefore, the trickle down effect of that is, is they need to go up on rates. What's going to happen is they're going to say, hey, we're not going to write new business for a little while. Nationwide might also be taking a closer look at renewals. He advises speaking with your agent and potentially hiring an independent agent that can handle different carriers. But expect similar rates because he says most insurance companies are raising rates right now. Nationwide doing this somewhat unprecedented, but not surprised. I think they're going to come out on the other side of this good. A local nationwide agent who wanted to remain anonymous tells 11 Alive that if you're an existing customer buying or renting a new home, you'll also have to undergo these, quote, strict binding requirements. But existing auto policies can still be changed. The agent adds that while Nationwide did pay out its entire 2023 budget for storm damage by the end of May, a lot of the remaining payouts came from newer businesses that had been written. Now, I did reach out to Nationwide, which told me these changes vary by state and by product. Now, the Office of Georgia Commissioner John King tells me it encourages Georgians to shop around when looking for insurance and says their consumer services team is available 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Monday through Friday to answer any of your questions. All right, Paula.